Breaking news, guys. Nigerians go talk, say, while I be like basically, not they finish. And sometimes, say, I go, they wonder why we say, would they do all these kind things to us, to ourselves? When we they have plenty problem, we, we get numerous, multiple problems in this country. But we, we know they, we know they try to shop like we really have a problem. But we busy, they put eye, they put mouth for waiting no consign us. Can we now say the war going on in Israel, the war between Israel and Hamas, is now bigger than the one we have in Nigeria? Even if they not say war, but we understand that the 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 fights against this banditry in the north and Boko Haram is more than war. You understand? And now the question is, why is it that people are not seeing this as a challenge to come and protest? You know, uh, challenge the government to do something about it. But we are busy doing what not consign us. You get, you go day where you day. They, 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 you, they, they talk, say, person will not get sense. Now you go carry elephant for head. Consider they use your leg, they pick cricket. And you get big elephant for head. Does it make sense? Nigerians, this will shock you. Abuja shakes as Israel Hamas war spread to FCT. See what fearless Muslims did that shaped world leaders. The Islamic movement in Nigeria, IMN, commonly known as Shaitis, gathered on Saturday to protest against the relentless Israel led bombardment in Gaza, Palestine, and demanded an immediate ceasefire to prevent further loss of life. The demonstration, which commenced at Banis Plaza, Wusitu Abuja, accumulated at the U.S. Embassy, resonating with impassioned anti-American slogans, Shaikh, Muri, May, Nara, Sokoto, a prominent member of the movement, issued its statement urging fellow Nigerians to stand in solidarity with the oppressed Palestinians. The document titled 100 Days of Non-Stop Genocide in Gaza, the U.S., a major party, detailed the harrowing consequences of the prolonged conflict. The statement revealed that since October 7 of the previous year, Israeli forces have intensified their bombing campaign, reaching an unprecedented level of destruction. The northern Gaza has witnessed a widespread devastation, rendering civilians nowhere to seek refuge. Over 30,000 bombs have been dropped by Israel during these 100 days, resulting in an alarming daily death through of 300 Palestinians. The situation in Gaza has died with nearly 70% of homes uh, potentially on, on completely destroyed essential infrastructure, including places of worship, markets, hospitals, and schools, having faced severe targeting, leading to irreversible damage. Sheikh Munu Sokoto accused Israeli Prime Minister of being directly responsible for these atrocities. Internationally, organizations have raised alarm over the humanitarian crisis unfolding in Gaza. The United Nations report that half of Gaza's population is at risk of starvation, while the World Health Organization highlights the spread of diseases exacerbated by Israeli attacks and ongoing siege. The statement condemn the United States and the United Kingdom for their unwavering support of Israel, even blocking the UN Security Council resolution calling for a ceasefire. It accused both governments of being complicit in the 100-day-old non-stop genocide against unarmed Palestinians, civilians, particularly women and children, drawing attention to Yemen's response to the crisis, the statement praised the Yemen's government for blocking ships 
ban for Israel has a means of pressuring the Prime Minister to stop the genocide in Gaza and left and lift the siege. It emphasized that attacking Yemen for this instance would be an attempt to obstruct the unfolding of international law. In a strong document, the IMN condemned the military attack led by USC forces on Yemen on January 11, 2024. The, the movement ascertained that this assault further exp exposed Americans' complicit in the ongoing genocide against Palestinian civilians. The IM, IMN Nigeria demanded an immediate and total cessation of the massacre in Gaza, urging the international community to stand against the Israeli terror attacks on Palestine in accordance with international law. So, when I don't hear the matter, so Nigerian uh, shite, they don't send message. They go, they meet Israel. He said, then they find trouble. Say, waiting, then do. Then they do for Israel. He don't do. Though Nigerians who have reacted to this are now saying that these people, they are pretenders. That in their region, killings are going on every now and then. They have not come out in mass to ask the government, you know, for help. But this is what they are doing. Mm -hmm. Well, Nigerians, when I don't see the matter, so I beg, what do I get to talk concerning this one? Make a drop one for you. Kindly share your thoughts below the comment section. Thank you.